What's going on everybody? How are you guys doing? Hopefully you're having a great Memorial Day weekend. For this video, I was scrolling through the seed section in the Descenders Discord and I found this this map on the peaks that has this crazy jump that you're not supposed to do. Apparently a lot of these dudes are trying to do it and the impact is just too gnarly. I'm gonna try it. I wanna see if it's possible. I think it'll make for a pretty fun video just because if I can get it, it'll be incredible. If not, it'll probably make for some really good slams anyway. I'll have the seed down below if you guys wanna try this one out. But uh, I've seen people asking me how to ride these seeds. So first of all, you want, what you wanna do is go into ride here and then scroll down to free ride and then build track from seed. It's that easy. You just go to enter seed and ride. You find your seed in the Descenders Discord. Again, you can do this on console. It doesn't have to be on the PC version, even though that's what I'm playing on. You can play any of these seed levels on console. So just go find the Discord on your phone or whatever, find the seeds that you want, and then you can go in and you confirm and it goes right to it. Peaks levels are usually always, always crazy. But I think I think the jump is from right here. Yes. Yeah, it's from here all the way down. So apparently it's possible to make it. And I want to see if I can get it done. Try and get as much speed as possible down this hill right here. And then, yeah, that's not it. <laughs> if I can land here off to the side, that'd be pretty cool too. But yeah, the impact is super gnarly. Man, I don't know, dude. I don't know if this is gonna be possible. I don't know if there's a way to get more speed. <laughs> the impact is so crazy. There's no way. It can't be possible. Man, these guys they on the Discord though has me wondering because some of them say they've actually made it to the landing. They just can't ride away from it. I want to at least just make it to the landing. I want to see if that's even possible. And then if I can get that far, I'll see if there's any anything I can do to make it further than that. I'm kind of thinking if I start up higher on the mountain than the helicopter, I might be able to get some additional speed. This is going to be tricky because I have to find a way to keep the speed and get back on the trail. Yeah, this is going to be really difficult. I think this might be the best way, though, to kind of get more speed for the double. Man, the peaks is so crazy. <laughs> might be able to... There might be another way I can get on the trail, too. Let me try something else. And if I go down here to the side, I might be able to hop over right here. If I hop further to the right, it might be possible. I'm just trying to find a way to get back onto this trail with as much speed as possible. Oh, that was a sweet gap, though. Not what I was looking for, but that was still pretty cool. This is not easy at all. And the thing is, I'm trying over and over to get back on the trail. When I do manage to get back on the trail, I'm only going to have one try at it. So, I better make it worth it. Watch. That one time I do get back on the trail with, with speed. I don't know if I'm going to have more speed this time, but I'll probably screw up and miss the ramp. When I hit the ramp, am I going further? Let's see. I think I might have went a little bit further. But I still don't think I got on the trail that fast. Oh! <laughs> I had some speed there. Speed right into the bottom of the helicopter. Here we go. No. I don't think so. I lost all my speed when I landed right there, actually. There's got to be another way to approach this thing. So what I'm doing now isn't working. There we go. That was pretty clean right there. Oh, there's the distance. It might be doable. As long as I hit it kind of flat, I should be able to keep my momentum. As long as I'm not like dropping out of the sky and just like taking all the weight on the suspension, 
if I can kind of like ease it down, like kind of flat, you know what I mean? That'll make it so much better, I think, to actually ride out of this thing. Because like, if you just drop out of the sky, you're gonna crash every time. But if you can kind of like hit it flat and just continue going straight instead of straight down, um, I think it might be possible. I'm gonna try it again off the helicopter now that I kind of know which way I need to, or how I need to hit this ramp. You don't want to go off the top. You want to go off the side at an angle. Right there, that's not going to do it. I'm just going way too high up, and if I somehow made it to the landing, there's no way I would ride out of it. But going off the side like that, it sends me way further out. But I have to get to the landing first. I still feel like there's a way to get more speed. I think I have enough speed from the helicopter. I really don't. <laughs> oh man, that might be a way to get back on the trail with some speed. I can hop down right here, then double over and step down, and then get back on the trail. That's going to be as fast as possible, I think. double over perfectly. The hardest part is getting back on the trail. <laughs> I got back on it but then slipped off to the right. This step down right here is actually really fun. Get on right after this checkpoint I think. Man it's still difficult to keep your speed going. Oh there we go. <laughs> oh right into the tree. Oh man. See, I'm going really fast, but trying to get back on the trail without getting out of control or losing speed is not easy at all. It's kind of crazy. It seems like it'd be so simple because like in your head, you know exactly what you need to do, but actually doing that is where the difficulty comes in. So there's a lot of steps to this whole process. You got that first step down and then you have to try and get back on the trail. Dude, that's the fastest way, but at the same time, I feel like it's the most out of control way. I'm trying the helicopter drop again. I just kind of feel like this is the most consistent way. And trying to make it to that, though, is so difficult. Can I land this? I don't think so. Yet. <laughs> Way too much impact. A little bit too far left. See, that's another thing, too. You have to make sure you have the thing lined up. I think I had the distance, though. Oh, is this it? I had the distance. The distance was there. Alright, so I know I can do it from the helicopter drop, or at least get there from the helicopter drop. Oh, dude, is this it? Just a little to the left. <laughs> I think that's about as bad as it gets right there for a worst case scenario. Come on, man. Even if I get there, I feel like I'm just going to blow out. <laughs> Well, my body made it far enough. That's the worst case scenario. Oh, there we go. Not enough lift, but the front flip was sweet. I just went through the ramp. Oh, man. That's the fastest front flip I've ever done. Is it? It's not possible. It's not possible. That impact was way too gnarly, even hitting it as flat as possible. It's just too big of an impact for uh, a landing that's too mellow. But that does bring up a question. Can I launch it to the right and somehow land on that big slope down there? Because that might be possible. I have to make something out of this, since the actual double that I was going for isn't going to work. I'm going to try and get one to work that, that I wasn't going for initially, 
and this is gonna work. I can tell right there. My dude wanted to ride out of it, so I think this is gonna be possible. <laughs> oh, that was another crazy front flip. Oh man, I thought I was gonna ride out of that one. I might need to make it a little bit further down the hill. There we go. Come on. Dude, the impact is so crazy. <laughs> Didn't even hit the jump. Oh, there it was. I rode out of it. I did ride out of it. I didn't even hit the jump, but I still made the step down. Oh, off the top of the lift tower. I don't think that's possible at all. That's just way too much impact to land on that thing. <laughs> the bike stuck in the lift tower, and so is my rider's head. That just shows how much impact is on this thing. Oh, this is it right here. I just hit that thing perfect. Yes, dude, I rode out of it. I hit a rock, I don't care. I rode out of it. I'm gonna count that one. Now I wanna ride the, the level for real. I wanna make it to the bottom and see what else is ahead of me here. The way it snakes back and forth right there is pretty tricky. And then this right here, I don't have the speed for this. Go into the into the cabin, but I don't know how I'll make it up on top. Dude, I'm struggling with this thing more than <laughs> more than the big jump. Okay, finally got through that thing. Dude, it's still pretty gnarly down here too. This is a difficult seed just in general. And it looks like it still gets steeper. That's a pretty cool level though. Yeah, this thing is really cool. <laughs> if I can avoid the trees. Oh man, you can triple step down that thing. And then right here, there's a gap across. And right into the finish line. <laughs> It counts. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button. Subscribe for more content if you're new around here. Check out the description for links for all of my specs on my PC as well as for my website for merchandise. I'll see you guys all again in the next one. Have a good one.